Well, hello everyone and welcome back. We are at Sister Mania and the crash site with Hope. Looks like the body was dead and we are going to bury the poor soul and do some scavenging and see what we've got. But I hope you're all well. Welcome yourselves back on in to uh, the sister fun that we're running here as well. And uh, hope you're having a great day. So she's bringing back an EM umbrella and a couple of, uh, what's she, so synthetic clothing. We don't need that whatsoever, so that's not helpful. We're in the middle of a dust storm as well, so no fun there. But I'm wondering what to do with the lights here. I think I want to expand it. But we're still doing the big expansion of the sensor turrets here, as you can see. So that's going to be a main focus for today to get some drones in. But thank you guys for being here. Do hit the thumbs up and subscribe if you aren't already as well. It really, really helps. And if you do want to be named after any characters in game, do consider supporting me on the channel with a membership or on Patreon. Thank you so much. And that's why you're seeing certain people named, the so robots and drones. And they're all going out just picking up stupid amounts of carbon. So we can still do loads with this. I still want to maybe get more turrets then. I feel like we should. Just for the sake of doing it, you know. I feel like, no, nah, let's go drone army. It's going to cost us... Do the drones cost... They don't cost any carbon. I'm trying to think. I think maybe upgrading these is a good shout. For sure. Yeah, let's get all those done to carbon. It's going to be the biggest change here, I think. We'll start using up some of that. And we'll obviously crafting the clothing as well. I'll make sure everyone's good on that. So I'll make sure everyone has carbon. There we go. Do you want to go and grab a bit of everything, please? There you go. You've got a full set. Paulette's got a full set. Mackie almost and Connor almost. Everyone is good. And what we'll do is make sure everyone has broken this stuff down. So in here we want to make sure... Yeah, that's cool. We're going to go with all of this being broken down. Any other junk items, then we'll, we'll make sure they're good as well. And I'll make sure everyone is still good with EM umbrellas. They also don't need this anymore, so we should probably get them something better, like gas masks. No, that's not for this one, is it? And we'll go up again in case anything's in here, which it is. We'll break all that down. And then we've got one more top floor with nothing in, so that's cool. But what we do need in here is one of these. So we'll start by copying that, getting that in for healing purposes. That'll do. And then that bedroom is covered as well. I don't think we're going to need anything more, really. We can wall this one off, but we still have this room here. We've got the VR stuff. So what we're going to do for the game here... Uh, da -da -da -da, what do I want here? It's a good way of leveling stuff up, but we want... Let's just go random. They can play whatever, to be honest. And then we need to make sure we have enough items to make sure we can repair all of this as well. There's going to be a fair bit of that. And here comes the construction of the motion sensors as well. We're going to be in year three soon as well. So this is what we're going to do. So active circuit's going to be seven. All right. And then what we're going to put on those is that. So let's, uh, I don't know. You can just wait until that t-shirt's gone, I guess. I may even go to the 2.0 snipers as well. So we can do that now. So we're going to craft five, four 2.0s. That's the plan there. Four 2.0 snipers is going to be for the best. We've got enough electronics. So we don't need to worry about that. I'm actually going to put that up to 10 as well. I think I might even copy this. Get another crafting bench in. So when they're bored, they can kind of go and do a bit of weapon crafting as well. I don't know if we've got anyone... That's leveled well enough for this. Not quite. You're incapable. Oh, yeah. Paulette's snid crafting 10, so that's fine. Mackie's almost there. Connor's not quite. And Hope is there, so we can get two of them crafting. Perfect. And then I'll just mirror this one with that. So, yeah, we'll go pure 2.0 snipers here. We've got more than enough to grab that. Look, 46 power cells, 28 CPU cores. <sighs> and we want to get a mech in as well, don't we? So should we get a combat mech? That's going to require a fair bit of metal, but I don't see why not. Why not have one right there just for defensive purposes, you know? And a DOS attack for Hope. I'm going to allow that to get done. No problem at all. And then what I'm going to do over here, we're not kind of on the scrap metal. I'm going to go up to 300. They're all mirroring, so that's fine. And what we're going to do is make sure we are scavenging once more. So they're down to salvage now, but there is quite a few around us now. So we can salvage all of these and they can work on that. The robots will do that as well. I don't have to get one more robot in to do that, to be fair. We appear to have missed one of those as well. Who's nearby? Hold on. Krista. That's a spec ops bot too. Get that before it goes because that's free, free ingredients, you know. 
And yeah, we got a good power circuit. So we've got four redundant ones here. So pretty good. And there's a bit of metal there as well. That's good. So when in the daytime, we are really, really fantastic here. And we could even take these even further. With the amount that we're putting on with the drones as well, we're going to have to copy a few more of these in. So we've got the power cells. Let's get another four. So that's another 200 power if we need it. Or is it more? Another 400 power, sorry. And Katina's in a risk of meltdown. So we'll keep a close eye on her. Dust in the eyes. I get it. I get it. Nobody likes dust in the eyes. All right, Hope's finishing off the combat mech there, and arcade machines have been done. So we're going to go upstairs, and I'm going to get one more arcade machine in here. So we're going to have a few games to keep them happy as well. That should help, and hopefully we can keep scavenging the metal. Now, fuel. This is where we need to consider what we're doing. So production, did we get that one done yet? What if we... I didn't want to draft you, sorry. Mobile turrets, then we're going into the fuel, aren't we? Okay, improved VR games, twice as much experience. That's actually really good. I don't know if I want the mobile turrets this run, guys. I think I want to go pure drones, actually. I'm going to clear some of this and change my mind, actually, as always. <laughs> you know me. Right, we're going to get night vision goggles. I might even go and get some, like... We need to produce ore to actually make grenades, but they are very fun. Yeah, we'll go oil extraction so we can craft fuel from that, I think. And we can just get green going. We're at that point now, aren't we? Trying to rely on the manure is not the best. So we can always go up to 200 on the green. And we can also stick in another green grass field. And we can do a pretty big one, right? And then this one we'll make sure is uh, on 200 as well. We'll get all that in. How are we doing everything else? Looks pretty good. Look at this bad boy. I'm not going to name the mech after you guys unless one of you wants it. Give me a shout. First come, first serve. So if you are a member of Patreon or the channel, let me know if you want to be the mech. And we can climb inside of you. All right, let's get out on some close expeditions then. So military ship is the weapons. Cargo pod debris. Let's go ahead and maybe send Connor on that one. Are there any that are a little bit closer? The explore. Ore deposits. No. We could do ore deposit, actually. Let's go do that. That'll give us some metal. And then what we can do is actually come in here. We can go smelt. Oh, we need to mine the ores first. And there's no queue. So we've got the night night vision goggles. Maybe craft a few of those. Let's get five night vision goggles. Why not, eh? We'll just get them in. We might move that bench up as well upstairs in a moment. But it looks okay for now. And let's go in here, see if there's anything else we want to do. Or do we want to focus on getting all the other stuff done? I think we may well do that. Maybe searchlights as well. Could get a few spotlights up. They are quite costly, though, on the CPU side. Maybe one flat cannon. Who knows? Scrap metal and ale. Well, Connor. Not bad. 70 scrap. That's good. We'll keep going out to these. And then oil extraction's done. So we're going to get that in. So we're going to start with the oil press here. And here's how we're going to do it. So we're going to have there. I'm actually going to allow them in here. So until we've done the oil, we can't select it in there anyway. We don't want it coming in here. And in the meantime, I'll also grab some manure from somewhere, if there is any. So we may as well. Why there's a random CPU core out there, I have no idea. And we're going to go get as much scrap as we can. None out there. There's the ore deposit, thank you. And then ale is here. Scavenging CPUs, try not to sneeze in other people's faces. Yeah, the scavenger CPUs isn't very helpful right now. Don't think, I think we've depleted our manure stores. So unless we go into taming and go and get something that will do that for us, there is no point. And I'm also going to go ahead and turn that off over there. It's cancelled the mining of those nests as well. It's too far away, we don't need it. We've got 3.2k carbon, way more than we need. And so let's go up. We've got to be careful because these will be on the same one. So that was seven, right? Yep, and then we can start the drones. That looks so cool, man. And you are on the wrong circuit. Ten. Get you changed as well. And how much do they cost? They don't cost anything other than this. We've got an attack coming, so I'm going to go ahead and we're going to start getting some drones in. Let's start with five, and I'm going to bring a pole this way as well, so we can actually get a row of them each side. We actually get a decent size attack coming now. Still not really. That's tiny. Not scary at all. And then we want to get a craft of the other fuel when we can in there as well. So we can extract vegetable oil. Let's go until two. Uh, that's way too much. Let's go until 100. We'll have enough to keep doing the uh, fuel 
as and when we go out as well. And let's get that switch turned on. And let's get someone in the mech. I don't even think we need the switch, to be honest, but who fancies it? Connor, you seem pretty happy. Go get yourself in there. And let's do the uh, the usual. Let's get a uh, barrage going. Not quite. So, I'm going to bring him over. <laughs> you could probably reach them from here. Get a bit of a barrage on the go. Turrets are on anyway. Not quite. Is he going to reach? He's not. Come over this way then, Connor. And the drones are going in as well. We'll get those on the control circuit in a moment so they're inactive. I'll get those guys named for you. Come on. I'm not even going to draft. Oh, poor Let's out there, though. We've got to be careful here. Should be fine. Let's get the barrage going. Come on, rockets. <laughs> uh, it did hardly anything, but it's cool. When you've got a few of these, the machine gun's just insane anyway. You'll start shredding them. Hello? Easy. Goodbye. I don't think those ones can quite reach, actually. Do they even kick in? What are you guys doing? Oh, they do. They do. Just takes a while. There we go. Everything dead. There you go, Connor. Get out of here. Let's get all this done. I think we've covered everything. Did we kill anything over there? I don't think we did. Cool. Back to it then. Let's get this turned back off. No problem. And let's get these onto control circuit seven. And we'll get some of these named. This should ramp up the attacks pretty nicely. And what I might get is the fuel thingies as well. So we want all these on seven, I think. Well done, guys. And once they're done, I'll get a few of you named for me. And let's come into. We've got the grenades, respirator masks as well. We're going to come in incendiary traps. And research insight. It's just crazy, that research insight stuff. I need one of you scavenging, please. Hope, come and do these. There we go, though. We're uh, four days off for the next year as well, which is awesome. And let's get the rest of these in. So, control circuit seven, control circuit seven. And let's start naming. Christopher Jansak. Sorry if I'm saying your name wrong. Thank you for your support. Tonya, thank you. Bruce Giannuzzi. I appreciate you. It's a double N, actually. Scott, thank you, mate. You become a drone, too. Rando, thank you as well. There we go. We've got our first ones named. You're, you're all on your spots. Thank you so much for your support, guys. Really appreciate it. I really, really do. All right. Can we keep getting the scrap coming, guys? We're, we're pretty short here. Although we're not, we've got 200 spare as well. We'll get some from these guys as we scavenge anyway, but I do want to keep that coming. I reckon we could break down some more of this, to be fair, before we uh, get any further. So maybe click on a few of these. Yeah, we get 250 scrap from that. And we're going to bring some more in, right? Let's go ahead and break all those down. Yeah, we've got some over here. I'm just going to bring some more in as well. And then hopefully we can start getting this. So I want to change it up on the uh, crafting side. I'm going to also place some of these at the, uh, the forefront here. Shooting star. We've got the explodey ones as a last line. And we'll get that crafted as well. And there's a shooting star that we don't care about. So let's go into the activities. Let's change this up a little bit. So we're going to want to get more people crafting. So I'm going to take Katina off handle. Paulette as well. The handling shouldn't be a problem anymore. Maybe just leave that. That'll give them less to do. Observe is fine. We don't need that anymore. A lot of scavenging going on at the moment, to be fair. But the crafting should come in as well. Who else? Paulette, to be fair, huh? you should be focusing craft now. That's all I want you doing. Might go for assemble as a main one. We'll leave it at that, though. We'll see if that helps. All right. We've got our first night vision goggles. Perfect. So let's... I mean, Connor, you get the first pair. Why not? We could get gas masks, too. We've got the toxic ash, obviously. I haven't got any... Uh, anything queued up. We could go down that route. Should be nice and easy. We got our first vegetable oil. Lovely. So we're going to get fuel mixing. And then do we even want to maybe improve VR games? I'd like her to get a research insight on that. That would be insane, wouldn't it? That's okay for now. I think everything's just looking pretty crazy. So we're fine. Thinking about getting one more 
of these, to be fair. Service bots are pretty good. Let's go ahead and get another service bot. We have the AI course. And fuel mixing was almost instant, so we're going to go ahead and craft up liquid fuel. And we're going to go until 100, and that's going to take precedence over the manure. Actually, yeah, it doesn't really matter. We're moving to that as our main source, actually, now that I say it. And there we go. We've got a trade coming in as well. This is going to be really handy, so let's see if there's anything we can get from them. And there is, so we'll buy electronics. I'll sell what we can to them. I'll keep hold of the synthetics from now on as something I can sell. Don't want the guys drinking that ale, so we'll get rid of that. And we could probably sell them some coffees and make some more. We've got the ingredients for it. Tea's not too concerned. We basically want to make enough for this. And that's way more food than she needs as well. So, and we're going to get more from breaking down. I think I may even go ahead and sell off some of this carbon. Free up a bit of our storage. They've got no money left, so we'll buy the rest of these... We'll take all their money, and that still leaves us with 2.9k, and then I may even... Is there anything else? Yeah, we come off way better there. That's two stacks of EMP grenades we could grab. Maybe some respirator masks, so I don't need to worry about it. Maybe not selling the tea. There's not much point in it, right? Or the coffee. Yeah, let's just not bother. We're still going to make loads. That'll do. We'll get the electronics in and sell off that stuff. And she should get an insight on this, so she's already 11% through, to be fair. It doesn't take her long anyway. And Katina is always going to risk him out. No, it's back up. She's fine. Okay, no worries. Blind Ender, you become a service bot. Thank you so much for your support. Really, really appreciated, my dude. Or dudette. Really appreciate you. Thank you. You get to be a service bot. I thought that was attack for a second, but it was just the trade. Just the boring old trade. Lovely stuff. That gives us another buffer of those if we need them with the more AI cores then. So, for those bad boys, do we get this, the attack bots? I tested them and they're just not that good. They die like instantly. The only way you can make them okay is if they've got snipers. But if you put them in towers, they just, I don't know. You know? Yeah, I, I don't know. I think it's just fine like this. I think we go with the drone army only. And then we keep getting some of these. So as we get scrap metal in, I think I'm going to continue to uh, buffer up this. So this should allow us to bring in even more. Is someone poked? Scavenge that, please. Don't waste it. Ah, oh, wow. Pure 109 scrap. That's actually really good. All right. How is fuel doing now? No one is focusing it because she's crafting this. I might get her... I oh, will let those happen then. Yeah, she's got one more to do, so I'll let her do that last one of those. So, let's change these up then. Probably get rid of the harvest tool for the night vision goggles. And then earbuds are no longer needed. Let's go ahead and grab you as well. And then we should be good. And then these guys will get something else as well. We've got the floors upgraded here, so let's get these moved into uh, carbon here. Let's recycle those, and then let's get the wooden plank roof. I'm not going to make them solar. We don't need any more. We have way too much. In the day, it's just insane. Look at this. And all these power cell thingies here anyway. I could even leave the turrets on permanently, to be fair, and just use power cells. We have 46 of the damn things. Why not get another 400 on the backup, right? And even so, the batteries would have to run down for them to even get used anyway. This is why I want to build more turrets. We have the carbon. Let's see if we can fit a couple more up here then. So I don't think we're ever going to need to come up this way. I think we can go boom, boom. Yeah, that's the play. I'm hoping they can get past them. If not, we'll have to build up the side as well. But we'll get another four turrets in on the same circuit. That should be fine. Hopefully they build the back one first, so I'll probably have to force it. Hope before you consume. No, that's fine. Actually, I'll leave her. I'll leave her. I'm actually going to take her off consuming the uh, the silicon now, and I'm going to get her focusing on silica energy. We've got loads, so keep her nice and happy for when she's going with that. And Connor's ill. I think he spread it. He, he came in, spread it all among us. And I'm seeing some nice euphorias and stuff coming in now for these. And here comes the attack. Finally, guys. Jeez, man. Hopefully it's nice and juicy. That's better. 13 spec ops. Nice. Okay. And turrets are getting done before I even get there anyway. So she is... Um, see, let's see if she gets stuck. I'm just going to draft her a second. Get her out. And then undraft. So she constructs it from the other side. If they get damaged, obviously she'll have a problem. But for now, <laughs> we'll just struggle that way, right? They are building it. So we're going to have to go with that. Let's make sure no one's outside. Katina, let's draft you. 
you can kind of come and operate that. Why not? And then the rest will kind of get up. But turrets are in a good place anyway, and Hope's going to go and construct that one. So they should get out of the way. Krista, finish that and then let me draft you, please. Oh, switch. Turn it on. I almost forgot. There we go. Get over there. You can stay there. And then Paulette and Mackie, let's draft you guys. You guys come up over here. Draft Connor. Actually, we got the towers, right? Let's get them in the towers. Hope I'm going to leave there. They should path correctly. I mean, there's not. it's not like there's any coming anyway, but we're fine. Let's get rid of all this so we can see. And let's slow it down. Here we go. This will be like insta. Not even going to shoot them with the rockets. Oh, they've got a sniper. Connor. You must not stand for that. Come this way. Wow, those snipers have some serious range. That's just proof what we're going to need to do then. They do go for the people though. They won't shoot the laser turrets until they actually start shooting them. So, shouldn't be a problem. Spec Ops bots are way tankier, but they are getting absolutely obliterated. Look how far they can shoot from, man. Connor took the brunt of that, unfortunately. Sorry about that, Connor. That's really unfortunate. And we'll make sure we're scavenging everything whilst these guys come in. Mackie's now taking a beating. Can you not reach from there, Mackie? What weapon she got? I'm going to undraft these guys. We can go somewhere else. That is crazy. I'm going to bring this out a lot further then. So we're going to need to uh, do this, I think. How far was that then? I'm just going to do it all the way down and then in. Screw it. No problem with that. And then we'll do the same again, but no problem. Undraft. Let's get rid of all this. You can all go bleed out and die or whatever you need to do. Get all this scavenged. And then I'm, I'm going to need to do this both sides. That was proof of how far the uh, thingies were. So the actual sniper ones can shoot pretty damn far, but that should stop them anyway. We'll get those deconstructed. I think there's one piece there. And then we'll grab in one little edge piece on each side. Like that. And then I'm going to bring this one out. I might even be able to... Uh, I'm going to have to remove these fields. I think I'm going to go ahead and just harvest these guys. Get rid of them. Uh, they're going to stay and get harvested when they can anyway. I don't think they can reach these ones. So, like before, we'll cancel those. And I'm going to copy these out. And just bring this maximum... All the way in and that'll cover the snipers getting to us there as well just found a couple of spec ops bots over here trying to snipe as well cheeky there we go we'll get all that broken down and get all that built and then i'll do the one corner one again so when they're at the front they do come out solar flare no problem and let's see where we're at in the day look at this we're in a plus still with those spinning but we'll get these turned off anyway and all of that needs building then guys let's get it done are we still salvaging and scavenging we are so let's turn that off make sure that most are working on this it should be more than fine and then one more day until we're into the new year as well and hopefully that bumps us up once more as well so with the amount of turrets we have we didn't even have a chance to test out the drones it's absolutely fine uh let's copy this in i want this to come this way and then i'm going to go ahead and get these on the same circuit so we're just going to pop some over here so five more over there, so that'll give us ten drones. They're not equal or anything, don't worry. I'm going to fill out the sides. I'm going to see how many drones I can get up to. All right, good bit of fence being done. Couldn't, wouldn't mind these ones getting done too, guys. That'd be fantastic. Uh, I was just going to say, if you haven't already, guys, please do go check out the uh, Infection Free Zone game that I've started playing on the channel as well. I didn't get as much love as I'd like on the first episode, so I'd really appreciate you uh, going out and um, checking that one out for me, guys. It would really, really help me. Um, and actually, it's a really fantastic game if you haven't even tried it or seen it. Do go check it out. I love all things zombie anyway, right? But there it is. There's the New Year's Eve as well. So we're going to allow the celebrations as always. That'll give us a good happiness buff. And that'll take us into year three quite nicely as well. So how are we doing? Fuel not kind of being crafted. We're still doing too much before crafting can happen anyway. But what I'm going to do... Do these bots do harvesting? Right. What I'm going to do is also get in... A harvest bot. So this is going to be for... I'm going to get in two of these, actually. And this is going to be for our scavenge, right? We're going to need fuel and stuff anyway. So I can start putting them all on crafting. So 
I can basically start to uh, put threes on scavenge and stuff and harvest all that sort of jazz so plant and harvest I can just change to threes and then pretty much leave them all almost doing simple tasks you know should be fine you know what I didn't do I didn't copy and paste onto Connor so let's do that now <laughs> see all of this stuff is just unnecessary if we get those two bots right but yeah we want these walls done so this side's now safe so all done and they should go across to this side so next attack we should be good no snipers touching us. Although, they can touch from here. Let me, let me just see something. Look at this. The drones won't kick in until they get past this area. So they're actually kind of pointless. Unless we move these in and we stack them up over here. Although, do we want the drones going out and dying constantly? I'm going to be honest, we don't. We want them as a backup in case we get overrun. So... Obviously, the last fight is where it'll get crazy, but at the moment, we're nowhere near that. So just for your reference, her sentience is still at 12%. So all in all, pretty good, right? If we want to start getting that up a bit, we can we can do this. So she researches afterwards. Um, and then we can take it off. There's the New Year's Eve, and then I can change research to a three on these guys. And then I can come in and just start spamming research of stuff. There's more than enough, and that will level her up anyway. No idea what... Like, I still don't even know if these beds work properly. I don't really see a need for them yet. Might get flat cannons. Might give defensive bots a go. I'll queue them up either way, right? We'll let them celebrate first, though. And then, when they're done with that, before I get hope to do that one, I'm actually going to go to... Is it gone? Ah, oh, the tachyon source is gone. I didn't realise it was on a timer. When they come, I need to send her, and I can level stuff up with that. Alright, rather than doing that hope, can you... What are we missing on these guys, then? Ah, what do we need? Metal. Oh, wow, we've got nothing to smell. Guys, hey, come over here. Come and, come and do some of this. We need the metal that you're going to get from it, please. There we go. That'll give us the metal. Let's get that done. They're pretty much built anyway, and then they can get back to that. I was wondering why we can't get these done and then everything's sorted. And that means I can go and salvage these again with our bots. And there's also some mining that can happen right here. So we're going to mine those three. And then I'm going to grab some more T-balls harvested as well. And there we go. We're scavenging. Hopefully, we can get some metal, please, guys. That'd be wonderful. Actually, there's some things we can break down for that metal, right? Let's have a quick look. Yeah, we can break down some more of these. Hold on. 19 there. We've got five over here. Let's break those down. It's not a lot that they'll get from that, though. Yeah, we'll leave it at that. Paul, let's do the assembling of these 2.0 snipers now. We're scavenging mech cores again. Oh, my God. Imagine if we get another one. I think we need to craft them. All right, the outer construction is done, though, so that's great. So we shouldn't have to worry. They should all path here now. They can snipe from, like, here. So it would even make sense to bring it out even further to force them in. But I'm going to see how that goes on the next one. If it's bad, we'll bring this out even more. So they have to push towards this. And as the, uh, the items come in, we're going to need to go ahead and make sure we break them down. Oh, my God. All right, this is going to give us a good amount of metal. So that's good. And I'm going to break that one down. I don't think we want that one that's busted up. It's too busted up, if that makes sense. Let's break all these old stuff down. New insect nest pretty nearby as well. So this seed has been really good for that type of thing, to be fair. Timothor, thank you so much, my dude. You get to be a battle drone as well. I can't fit the full name in, so... I appreciate the support, though. And there we go. We have a Tachyon Source. Woohoo! Let's go straight to that. 12 plus days. Holy crap. It's not very far away, so you can go straight to that, Hope. Pretty sure we're getting... Are we getting the oil in now? No, we're still not getting that done. Is that down to the amount of green we have? It is. Okay, I've taken them off harvest, haven't I? We haven't got any that's grown yet, so... All right, cool. Can we get metal, please? Please give me metal. I actually didn't think I'd be saying that. I don't need any of this. Just metal and an AI core. Holy crap. Okay, I don't mind the AI cores. Dragolithic, thank you for your support. You get to be a drone as well. And Andrew, appreciate your support, my dude. You get to be a drone also. Thank you, guys. Oh, Paulette reached crafting 10 as well. I almost missed that. Beautiful. But yeah, we started off year three pretty well. We are highly advanced, I would say. So yeah, I'm hoping for more, um, more attacks, though, definitely. We need them to big up, you know. Let's break that last one down. Still got 2.3k carbon as well, so we're good there. And Tachyon Source, here we go. Oh my god. 
Research 3D printers. Replicate one random weapon. We don't need any of this. Don't need that. Don't need that. Don't need that. Yeah, definitely don't need any of these. So, nanotube printing is done. <laughs> I kind of want her to do that research, but it's fine. Um, You know what? We can get into meat printing too. I might just go into like a huge farming kind of thing. Once we've got these farming bots, it's not going to be a problem, right? We can print blinking meat. There are ways around doing stuff, you know? So let's go ahead and get another patch here. That'll do. We'll go around that. And this is obviously going to be until the same again. Well, we'll go 300. Physical free for Mackie and we're harvesting that stuff. So we're getting these done. Let's get these renamed. Bobby, thank you, my friend. Thank you so much. And Martin, thank you so much as well. You, you guys are my harvest spots now, so I can go out and just do some serious scavenging for all this metal that we need. So I'm going to go a little further afield now and see if there's any, like, mining and stuff we can do. We've cleared all this out so we can get scavenge. And what I'm going to do is actually take hope off that completely. And then turn the rest of them onto a four for it. They don't need to do it now. The bots will go and do it. I'm going to make my life ten times easier. There should be some more iron around as well. But yeah, we want to get a bit of a surplus of that as well. Blood Angel, thank you so much for your support. You are a drone. And Miss Kirsty Lee, thank you so much as well. I really appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for sharing your support towards me. And some of you have been members for a long, long time now. So like 18 months. You've got the silver beard, you know. So I really appreciate it. Thank you. Let's get these weapons swapped out for these guys that don't have the uh, 2.0s, so you can kind of do a little bit of an upgrade. And then we'll break down the other things that we are seeing, so we'll make sure all of this is gone. Let's get those broken down. We no longer need the earplugs, so let's clear that space. And let's check in on everyone's armor. So you're fully geared, you're fully geared, you're fully geared. You're not yet, actually. So let's go ahead and get all that on with you. And then Connor... We'll also get you sorted when we've got them spare. And there we go. So it's just Connor and maybe Hope. But she's got 1.0 anyway, so I'm happy with that. And there we go. That's pretty much all my members named too. So uh, any more, they're just not named yet unless I get any more. As always, guys, that's going to be where we end this one out. So thank you so much for joining me. As always, really, really appreciate you. I hope you like the start of the drone army. And hopefully soon we'll get the attacks ramping up to kind of showcase it a bit more. But as always... Have a great day, take it easy, and I'll see you in the next one.